Capital Mariah Carey to start your Memorial Day off today. It is 624, a live look at downtown Dallas where you see those low-lying clouds. We'll check in with Kyle Roberts in just a bit to see what that means for your Memorial Day weather. I, I don't have to tell you that these past few months have been hard for all of us and be it stuck, being stuck at home with nowhere to go. But what about those folks who have no home to go to? Sean Giggy introduces us to a woman who is making sure that everyone is cared for. 20 years ago, when LaToya Moppins had no job and no money, she vowed that one day she would do everything she could to help people. All she needed was a way. It saved me. And this was it. Pickles. <laughs> I never in a million years imagined that pickles would bring any source of togetherness. LaToya's business, Glorious Gherkins, is booming. <laughs> Her flavored pickles can be found in all 50 states, foreign countries, and even Globe Life Field. Such a powerful combination. Thanks to her success, she has kept her promise. It feels good. LaToya regularly gives back to the homeless, but says it's needed now more than ever. Look how they're living. Every week since this pandemic began, LaToya and an army of volunteers have spent time with the homeless. Doing what we do best, giving back to the community. They hand out food, toiletries and other essentials. More importantly, they are there to cure loneliness. And I'm a living witness that you can change and you can do well. Long before social distancing, most people were already keeping the homeless away. LaToya says that kind of neglect can be demoralizing. She knows because before she had a successful business, she had nothing. I know that feeling. I know that feeling of desperation. I know that feeling of people making you feel worthless and not good enough. Just because people are homeless does not mean that they're animals. They deserve the same type of love and treatment. Sometimes when you've got nothing, being loved is everything. And LaToya says, if this pandemic has taught us anything, it's that our health and our happiness is at its best when we live for others. It should be showing you that you should be doing it too. Yeah. That's it. You should be doing that too. In Dallas, I'm Sean Giggy. W